Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I sure appreciate you stopping by. I am wandering around southern central Oklahoma, exploring all the campgrounds on Lake Texoma. And currently, I am set up at Lakeside, and I'm literally Lakeside, <laughs> at Lakeside. It's really too windy, and we just had a cold front blow in. It, it's February 4th, and it's to be expected but it's it's really too cold to get on the scooter and run around uh and it's definitely too cold to be sitting out here fishing uh, so i'm gonna get in the truck and we're gonna go explore platter flats that's an equestrian campground not too far from here so let's get on the road and head to platter flats Well, here we are, Platter Flats Recreation Area. This is a beautiful little campground, but it's, it's rather high and that north wind is coming off that lake, it's cold. They've got a, about, I don't know, eight or nine really nice flat concrete pads, water in 50 amp, and then there's a pull through there with the big fifth wheel in it. The rest of the sites here at Platters Flats, well, let's go, let's go take a look at them. They're, they're not exactly premium. So Platter Flats recreation area actually has a boat ramp. That's a steep one. And it's a single laner place to park your trailer courtesy dock and fishing pier and so far this is the least windy place I've been this morning Platter Flat Recreation Area. Let's go see a couple more things. I'm not even going to get out of the truck for this. <laughs> Platter Flats has a group pavilion. So y'all can come out and have a big old fish fry. Let's go see a couple more things. So Platter Flats recreation area when I was looking at it on recreation.gov it was not entirely clear it, because it is portrayed as an equestrian campground now you get out here and I find that that's not entirely the case there are you don't have to have a horse a lot of equestrian campgrounds require you to, to have a horse to be able to camp but you can come out here and it looks to me like uh, because we've got campers over here with no horses although there are corrals close by or paddocks not a corral it's a paddock in case you don't know the paddock is smaller than the corral there are quite a few sites over here back back in the woods they're they're rough sites they're gravel pads on a gravel road The main equestrian campground is out there, and that is closed. 
These sites are all power electric only with water close by. But in February they have, in the winter they turn the, the water off. There's one shower facility up there. Let's go check that out. It looks like you're not allowed to use the shower facilities here at Platter Flats during off season either. Looks like it's a brand new, brand new facility, but look how beautiful that is. I bet during the summer that is just stunning. Even got a hitching post right here at the restroom. Platter Flats. So Platter Flats Recreation Area on, on Lake Texoma. Uh, it, it's definitely a, a, a unique place to take your your horse camping. They got all kinds of trails to ride. and I know your horse would just love to go camping deep into the woods. It's, it's a really pretty area. It's a really pretty campground. Not a whole lot of paved roads, uh, so it's not real uh, ADA friendly. Now some of the, the, the campsites on top of the hill that have concrete pads, I would say that they're ADA friendly, and that's where it stops. <laughs> so you could take a wheelchair down onto the fishing platform, but other than that, there's, there's not a whole lot for the mobility challenge to do here. And I say that, this is, it says it's a road. And I don't know where it goes. So why don't we hop on Little Red and just go see? All right. Got the camera all set up. Got the harness on so I can use both hands. So let's go on a little, a little red trail ride. Looks like that's the end of the road. Very interesting. We have a map. So I guess we're going to do a little bit of a... <laughs> yeah, we're not going to go too far. This road is just so, so very rough. And it's windy and cold. This is actually the end of the, all of the road in Platter Flats. Fishing dock is right there. Looks like we're done here.
almost wasn't worth putting the the camera harness on but then again it it was such a pretty place If this is your first visit to Dude RV, hey, remember to click on that subscribe button down there. I'm traveling all over. I'm traveling all over. I sure appreciate y'all riding along with me. If this is your first visit, please, click on the subscribe button. Thank you. For those of you who have been following along, I really appreciate it. Thank you so very much. That's why I'm doing what I'm doing. It's all for you. All right, with that being said, y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs>